try, check, and revise, and work backwards. Now, these are a couple of different approaches to solving word problems. Uh, and I'm going to do the same problem twice just to show you how it works. Uh, and the answers will obviously match. But I'm going to draw a line down the center here. I'm going to do the try, check, and revise over here, and the work backwards over here. So if you look here. So I want to figure out the answer to this question. Baby crocodiles are about 12 inches long when they hatch and grow 10 inches a year. How old is a crocodile that is 42 inches long? OK, well, so what do I need to do? I need to figure out what am I looking for. I'm looking for how old is the crocodile. So how many years old it's going to be. So What's the information I've got? And this is all very nice and neat. It's, uh, if I look here, the crocodile is 42 inches long. It grows 10 inches a year. And baby crocodiles are 12 inches long when they are born. So if I want to try, check, and revise, all I would do is I come up, could come up with an equation. And well, maybe I'll just say to myself, well, Let's say that the crocodile is 10 years old. If that was the case, then the baby crocodile would have started off being 12 inches long. And if that was the case, and it was 10, it was uh, 10 years old, then it would now be, well, 10 times 10 inches long, uh, because it was 10 years old. So. Now it's going to be 100. So that would be one big crocodile. And it would be 112 inches. And that's not where we're at. We're at 42 inches. So we know 10 is way too big. So that's the first one I put down, 10. OK, so now let's try 5. OK, so 12 again, same thing, because that's how big the baby crocodile is. Well, if it's 5, then how many inches would it grow? It would grow 50 inches. And it looks like we're getting closer, but we're not there yet. So 5 would be 50 inches, and that would be 62 inches long. And that's not going to work. So let's try, mm, you still need to go down a bit. We're in the, going in the right process. So let's try instead, oh, let's try two years. 12 inches to start off with. And now it's going to be 20, 20 inches long, because it's it's 2 times 10, 20 inches long. And I'm still not there. But the important thing to realize is that I went ahead and I switched. I went from being over to being under. So I know it has to be between 2 and 5. And so now I'm just going to guess, and I know what the answer is. And if you're following along, you can probably figure this out. 3, and so 12. And sometimes I might just want to, it's not that, it's not that, it's not that, after I figured it out. 3, 12 inches, it starts off with. It goes to 30 inches. And that's going to be 42 inches. So yes, this would be our answer here, 3. Now, for that would be an example of try checking and revising, because again, I'm trying a bunch of different answers, and I finally get to the one. But I'm mentally thinking to myself, am I getting closer? If I started here, and then I said, oh, well, you know what, that, that's too big. And then I say, oh, well, maybe, maybe it's instead 20 years old. That would be going the wrong way. So you just need to kind of logically deduce that. So if you look here, um, the second way is work backwards. And if you think about it, the crocodile is 42 inches long. So we've got a 42 inch long crocodile. And we know it grows 10 inches each year. We're trying to eventually get down to 12. So all we have to do is subtract 10. That would be one year. And that would be 32. Then we subtract 10 again. That would be the second year. So it would be two years. And that would be in 22. And then we subtract 10 one more time. We come up with our answer, which is 12. And that would be the third year. 
So 12 is going to be what we're trying to get to because we now have 12 as our as our answer. It took us a total of one, two, three years. Obviously, crocodiles would grow from smaller to bigger, but we're just working backwards. That's why it's called that way. So that's where we're at, and we are done.